guys, it's Shock and Shannon. And Paul. <laughs> and today we have a video for you that's gonna be kind of fun, maybe, but mostly we're doing it as an informational video for you guys. Yeah, we actually really struggled with whether we were gonna do one of these videos or not. Um, as you see, we have two packages of... Supposedly. Shopkins. <laughs> here. Um, one of them is not real. And if you've watched our videos, you can probably tell right off the bat which one isn't real. Um, they both say Shopkins on them, but this one right here is completely fake. Yes. Even though it says Shopkins on it, it's not really Shopkins. It was made by a company somewhere overseas that just stole the idea through, you know, these on a manufacturing line, copied the card, and is selling them as Shopkins, but they're not official Shopkins. Yeah. So the reason we wanted to do this is because a lot of you have asked us questions about, is it safe to buy from eBay or other online sites? And the answer to that question is yes, it is absolutely mm -hmm. safe, but you do need to be aware of what you're purchasing. So, you know, we're just going to point out some of the things to show you to look for, to know whether it's real Shopkins or not. Right. Okay. So let's take a look. Let's take a look at this one. Um, as you can see side by side, these look very similar. Um, actually, I'm gonna have Shannon move hers off screen for a minute. Let me, can I just show something real quick? Yes. As far as the card goes, mm -hmm. the real one, you can see it's got the inside there. There's a yellow, very faint um, edge, and then it's white in the middle. Look at this one, solid yellow and very polka dotty, and you know, you know that's it's a, a big difference. That's a good catch. I actually didn't see that. Um, what I was going to say is, really, the the card looks almost identical. It's the, a photocopy, it, that's it, why. Yeah, it's a photocopy. It's a color photocopy. The colors are just slightly off. They're not off by much. But they're just, not as vibrant. They're not as vibrant, yeah. The, the, the official card's a lot more vibrant looking. The pinks are just brighter. Um, everything's brighter. Taco Terry is where I see a difference. He just looks a little bit faded and not as... He doesn't pop as much off of the fake card. If you look on the back, and here's something that really bothers me. It, it has, there's no misspellings that I have seen. The, the back looks really good as far as the checklist goes. It has all of Moose's information on it. It even has the official barcode. So if you took this and you scanned this at a, at a Target or Walmart or something, mm. it would scan. Yeah. And if somebody got one of these and they didn't know any better and they took it back to Target or Walmart, they would put it on the shelf and sell it. That's true, not knowing. As real. So that's probably one of the most important things is, number one, that would be very, very rare that you would ever see one of these at a Target or a Walmart. I don't want to scare you and say that, you know, your stores are, you know, are going to have those. They probably never would. But the biggest thing is you need to know what the Shopkins look like. That's really the only way you're ever going to be able to tell. And if you flip it over real quick, mm -hmm. on the real one, the moose is the green logo, oh, like standard. Right. And on the fake one, it's, it's white. It's not a colored in moose. So right, that is right. one difference on the back. Yep. That's, yeah. So there, there's some very small differences. Shannon's really good at spotting these small differences. I play those games. Like, what's, yeah. what's different between the two pictures? <laughs> So that's kind of that's kind of the packaging. The packaging is is good enough to fool you if you don't know what to look for. If I walked, would you bring that package back up here, Shannon? Yep. If I walked into a store and I saw these Shopkins on this package, I wouldn't think anything about it. I would probably buy it. Yeah. Because because I know these Shopkins so well, I would be like, okay, those are the those are the official Shopkins. Even though the card's wrong, I would probably I would buy them and be fooled if somebody yeah. made good enough Shopkins. So that's the thing to know the characters and what colors they're supposed to come in. Yeah. Now we are going to open these up, um, and then we're going to compare them to the originals, and we're going to see if we can spot any differences. So let's open these up and see what in the world is inside here. Okay, we have opened the package up, but. First of all, I just want to tell you, as I opened it, I was feeling this card feels totally different. Like, it's a different kind of cardboard. And you'll also notice right there away when you open these that they're fake because they smell toxic. They smell they bad. They stink so bad right now. <laughs> yeah, they do. Um, we do not have a Season 3 real checklist right here to show you. But one thing I noticed right off the bat on this checklist from the fake 
is the colors are off. Yep, they sure are. I can Look see that. Look at Taylor Rain, Jennifer Rain. They're not teal, mm -hmm. which is the colors the Shopkins actually are. They're green on here. And none of the colors are vibrant and bright. Yeah. We'll flip that over. Let me see the, okay, the stationary. Now on the front of the fake card here, it says that the special editions are supposed to be polished pearl. So let me just start with with this one. This is going to be one of the one of the biggest giveaways. So th these were made in China. Um, that's where we bought these from. Yes. Okay. Actually, I don't know where they were made, but we bought these from a seller in China. This is the Shopkin that came in the fake package. This is an original Shopkin right here in the blue. It's Stella Stapler. So Stella Stapler comes in two finishes: the purple and the green. She doesn't come in any yellow, and she doesn't come as a clear glittery Shopkin. Well, there there aren't any glitter Shopkins in season three. Right. So. And and even according to the checklist that this comes with, it should be a polished pearl. Yeah, or green or purple. Right. <laughs> so so you're not you're not even going to be able to match up to your checklist. So th this is just something that really bothers me because I hate to think that you know probably kids aren't buying these, but parents are. Parents or grandparents that just don't know what to look for. Yeah. All right, I know I'm going out of order here, but let me show you. This is a regular Shopkins Season 3 shopping bag. This is one of the fake ones. I hope our lighting is good enough to pick it out. There's this is really shiny. Yeah, there's not a lot of difference, but this is really shiny, and the little dots on it are smaller, and the Shopkins logo is smaller. I don't know why that is. I don't know like when they were trying to copy it, how they got why they got those things wrong. Also, it's in a different spot, but that would be tough to spot and package. But again, the Shopkins, the original one, just looks better, more crisp. This just looks, it looks shiny, but it looks just kind of dull and not as impressive, I guess. And feeling it in your hands compared to the regular, this one feels a lot more substantial. This one feels cheap. Okay. All right. Let's so move on. Let me show you one. So this is Pee Wee Kiwi, and Pee Wee Kiwi never has come in this color. Nope. You're fake. <laughs> There's the original Pee Wee Kiwi. Um, the holes in the bottoms are bigger, let too. Let me feel them. You can even feel a difference yeah. in the plastic yeah, quality or something. It's, it's like different. It's like a harder plastic there. You, the, shop, yeah. the Shopkins plastic has just, I mean, they're not squishy, but it has just a slight amount of give to it. Oh, and they stink so yeah. bad. I can't get over it. Like, how bad these smell. Yeah. <laughs> okay, which one do you want right. to show? You want me to show the fake? Yes. So what also bothers me about these is they most clearly have taken Shopkins and just totally stolen the the mold. Yeah. And made them. Because, I mean, these Shopkins look good as far as characters. Like, this Hattie Hat, she looks good. Yes. I actually really like her in the hot pink. I do, too. But but it's fake. It's not a real Shopkin. And, you know, that's that's not good. So you, you need to pay attention to your checklists and mm -hmm. know Hattie Hat doesn't come in this color. So that would be a giveaway that you're buying a fake. Yeah. Hello, I am Hattie Hat. And that was not. I'm the real Hattie Hat. Yeah. Don't put the real ones with those fake ones. All right. <laughs> Spaghetti time. Spaghetti time. This one is horrible. Yeah. Like, horrible. <laughs> this is just horrible. I would never eat blue spaghetti with something on top of it. I want to say poop. It looks yeah, like that's poop. What, that's what it looks like. It's. They just don't have anything in this color. They don't make these neon blue and neon pink like that unless you got the target special edition which are real but they didn't have these characters right. in them so i mean they're just they're horrible okay this one this is the real ginger fred over here that i have this one is actually the closest to the original in my opinion if you didn't have a ginger fred like the original one to, to look at and somebody showed you that i would probably say okay well yeah that might be the real one um until I felt it. Well, but this one's carrot colored, and Ginger Fred doesn't come in carrot colored. That's a good way to think about it. If you see one that's carrot colored, it's also, not quite... Also, painting jobs are bad. Yeah. And this Shopkin is caved in on the front. I don't know if you can see that on I camera. Can I can see it, It's yep. not flat like Ginger Fred is. It's kind of caved in. Yeah. Now, you guys have seen us open a ton of Shopkins on our channel. Every now and then we get a Shopkin that has some quality issues. A little bit of paint is wrong, or it's just not quite right. But that's rare. Um, okay. 
Next so here's week. another one, Suzanne. I mean, she's just horrible. She doesn't even oh, have yeah. the stitching on the side like Suzanne uh, should. I, I see it a little bit. It's green. It's tough no, to see. No, but see, it's like colored. Yeah. She, she just. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Who do you have now? Lana Banana Bread. Lana Banana Bread. Okay, I have the purple one. I mean, this is just yucky looking. Yeah. It, just everything. It's just not quite right. Yeah. So. Okay, now Susie, Sunday. Grabbing. Sorry. None of these come in these colors. Right. And they just don't look as good as the originals. They just look They're just slightly looks off. Exactly. Here's Scony. And see, now she, like, her colors aren't staying where they should. Yeah. The yellow has is, is moved into the white cream. The red has moved into the white. And here's right. another supposed polished pearl. Read a ruler, but she doesn't come in this color. And if you look at her, the numbers are not clear and they're not evenly spaced either. If you look at that read a ruler, the yeah, numbers are like more evenly spaced. This one, mm -hmm. it's just off. This almost looks like a sticker on the front or something. Yeah. It just looks bad and it's bent. <laughs> <laughs> That's one thing you don't want with a ruler is a bent ruler. Okay, we're each going to open up one of these. Even the bags feel different. Yeah, they do. Okay, we're each going to open up one of these. Come on, limited edition. Oh, yeah. Well, hey, if you're making fakes. A fake limited edition. If you're making fakes, why wouldn't you put limited editions in there? I have Pop Rock. Oh. Now, Pop Rock's interesting because she actually does come in pink. She does come in pink, but, but not that color. she does not look this bad. And I got... You got Taylor Rain I with got Taylor, pink eye. Yeah. Her <laughs> eye is printed over her mouth, so it looks like she has pink eye. And the color... I mean, I actually do like the color, but it's there's just something wrong with it. Like it, yeah. it just doesn't feel right. You felt no. a lot more of those than I did. They just don't feel right. They don't feel right. They don't look right. They're just not right. Yeah. So, parents, grandparents, people out there, I I wouldn't purposely buy these just because you can get them cheaper usually yeah. or something because it just supports people continuing to fake them. The only reason why we purchased it is just so we could do this video, and these are all going in the garbage. We refuse yeah. to even not let anybody them have them yep. because... It's just, it's wrong. It's wrong to knock off the hard work that a company has done. Exactly. So, hopefully that helps you guys a little bit. If you have any questions, you can let us know. We'd be glad to answer them. Yeah, and, and a question that we a lot of times get is about buying on eBay. Shannon, Shannon mentioned about that, and I said that these came from a China seller. Um, a rule that we typically follow, even though we know the Shopkins backwards and forwards, and we, we yeah. feel like we can spot a fake in a, in a heartbeat, we don't buy. We no. don't buy Shopkins or or things that you can get, you know, here in America. We don't buy them from Over, from, from China from sellers. China. Yeah, from China sellers. We, we buy from the United States or Canada. We've mm -hmm. never had problems because we've bought a lot of season ones and stuff. Yeah, and one of the big reasons why is we've just seen a lot of fake products coming from those sellers. Um, you know, we've seen Legos be knocked off. We've seen Shopkins now. A lot Monster of Monster High. Yeah, Monster High. A lot yeah. of popular toys get made as fakes over there and then sold. Yep. So bottom line is I don't think you need to be afraid to purchase online. Mm -hmm. You just need to kind of inform yourself and know what you're purchasing. Um, again, if you have any questions, we'd be glad to answer them. These things are going in the garbage and we're going to go scrub our hands because they stink. They smell horrible and who knows what these things were made out of. Yeah. So <laughs> thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and check back for another Shopkins video coming soon. Goodbye, garbage. <laughs> and we will see you soon. See you later. Shannon. It's Shannon versus Paul. That's right. Surprisable style. Surprisable Shannon versus Plush Paul. Ooh, oh, very cool. Yep. So what are we doing, Paul? Okay, so we are each going to open up five Surprisables today. Awesome. Five Surprisables. And you guys get to vote on who got better.